it's it's it is really one of the things. But see, you know, you know, Jared, that in Kenya the difficulty is that we we always we seem to think that poor are not human. They're not quite human. They're not quite there. So as long as you're poor, we will forget you. We will forget you. So really, it's also a thing for us, even us as Kenyans, to begin rethinking our own minds. Which is why when police go and shoot so-called mungiki, as long as they're poor, youth is fine. But the moment it's the son of a former MP who's shot and said mungiki, uproar. The whole country wakes up. All oh, the police are killing. The police are killing. They've been killing. They've killed, you know, at least 500 people. But only when it's, it's only when rich people can avoid it. So it's, it's something we have to work at ourselves. Because you talk to Kenyans, I mean, I, when this so-called Mbiki was happening, you talk to Kenyans and say, ah, but these are criminals. I say, how do you know they're criminals? Because they're poor and they're young. And they're unemployed. So we just, we support the police. You know, we support them. I wanted to ask you two questions really, but first, two thanks for a very interesting and touching film and as well as, as an interesting debate. Uh, my first question is regarding the ICC. If we would see an arrest warrant and an indictment against the top Kenyan leadership, could we expect the Kenyan leadership to abide with that as a state party to the ICC? Uh, I think that the Bashir case is obviously different, but I think that what we have seen during the past years is, is that cooperation with the ICC is really one of the main issues if we do want to see justice being done de facto. Um, my second, second question is rather with regard to the general trend on, on the, the position on, on impunity and the fight against impunity on African states. Uh, we have seen during the past year, I would say, uh, within the framework of the African Union, several African states that have moved to a rather <coughs> critical position, I would say, on, on the fight against impunity in general. Uh, the uh, juxtaposition of, of peace and justice is being uh, emphasized and um, uh, issues such as uh, the this ICC, its role, the independence of the prosecutor, universal jurisdiction and immunities for state officials are being put on the agenda on several levels, including the UN. And uh, I do think that we see a rather worrying trend here where we see a number of African states who have formerly been rather positive to the ICC, to the fight against impunity in general. Do we see a, a moving negative trend towards a, a, uh, an argument for, for just national prosecutions against international justice, uh, so to say. And do you think that the reason for this would be in that case that it's too close to home for the moment, or are there other issues at stake as well? Thank you. Good questions. I, I think on the, on the cooperation, both, the, both President Kibaki and Prime Minister Odinga have, have asserted not once, a few, but many times, that they will cooperate with the ICC. But that's a statement, you know. Uh, I, particularly, Kibaki is not known to keep his promises and and, uh, and deals that he signs. He can sign anything. He may not necessarily keep it. Um, so it's not. It's not for me. It's not enough for that. I think the bigger thing is that um, is that Kenya is is very vulnerable to pressure, particularly international pressure, in a way that Bashir isn't with his oil. So, uh, so we, our, our, all, our, all of us, our fingers are crossed. Are crossed. We don't, we don't discover oil yet, um, uh, because once we get oil, then we are, we are, we are finished. The country is gone. You know, uh, pick up and I'll be moving to Sweden myself. So, you know, it's gone. So we don't want to discover oil, I tell you, because we, we, the country is gone. Um, so it's still very vulnerable and very susceptible to, to, to pressure. So I think there will be arrests. And the difficult, the difficult part, of course, would be an indictment against Kibaki. Or Odinga as Prime Minister and, and, and Head of State. Uh, that would be difficult in terms of what does this mean now. And I think um, if Ocampo is smart, um, he would I vow Ocampo I wouldn't go for them yet. That, that doesn't stop. The you know, indictments don't stop. We don't have to do it yet. So I go for ministers and others at that level. And then five years later I go for Kibaki and Odinga. And if, they're, if they've got evidence for them, you go for them there. Because you go for them now, then you, you have you run the risk of not achieving anything. Are they on uh, Kofi Annan's list? I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I guess, uh, I, I'm just seeing the Council of Justice, uh, the Wako or something. Yeah. But uh, not many names have been. No, they, they're not, they're, no one knows the names, actually. No, no one knows the names. Um, I, I don't, I mean, it, it's, um, it, it wouldn't be surprised to me if, 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 if one of them or both of them on that list. Yeah. The, the evidence was quite strong. Be. But on the other question about Africans and ICC, 
May I just ask? I think that the campus track record isn't really just to go to on mid-level, as we both know. So if he would decide to go on the really, you know, the top level prime minister and, and president, what would be the effect you think on the ground? Well, I, I do not, again, it's, it's, it's going to be more than the president and the prime minister. I mean, I think when you look at the yes. theatre of violence, there will be some ministers yeah. who would have acted without authority from the president or prime minister who would be arrested. And they're pretty senior. Um, I think that um, it's not mid-level. I mean, the, the levels we're talking about in Kenya are not the people. They, almost, almost every Kenyan here, if you ask them to name five people, they'll name you. And almost all of us will agree on those names. You know, we know who was in charge of Eldoret, mm -hmm. Naivasha, uh, Kisumu, Nairobi. We know. You know, we can name who was in charge from our own analysis. Um, but if he names, if he goes for Kibaki and Odinga, then I, I, the impact will be. I think many people will say, "Fine, let them go." But the, but the more practical thing this is the more practical thing will be how how do you affect an arrest? Okay. How do you actually affect? But in terms of Kenyan support, I mean, I think that if the evidence is strong against Kibaki, people will say, "Let Kibaki go," or Odinga, let him go, let him go. That will be. But as again, but the more important part for Kenya is the balance that the, both sides of the political divide. Are part of the list. If Okamo goes for only one side, then there's going to be tensions. There's got to be both sides of the political divide. And then I think that, that, that helps. Now, in terms of, of the African governments and leadership and, and impunity, and I think they just didn't think that they would be, they would be indicted. They didn't, when they were signing the ICC, they were thinking their influence on, on the processes in Africa and outside Africa. But it's got to be. I mean, it's. I, I've no. I have no doubt because I you know everywhere I've been in Kenya, in the heart of of Luoland where Odinga is, or the heart of Kikuyu land where Kibaki is from, people support the ICC strongly, very strongly. It's a strong support. So the people themselves understand that we can't hold our leadership accountable. Somebody else should, and that's why ICC was formed. But of course, nothing uh, takes away from the idea of national. Uh, prosecutions and, 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 and judges. That's what, that's what we need to be. But until we're able to crack the, the knack of those top people, you know, we have not, no national, uh, you, you just aren't very clear about it, but a lot of them are beginning to get nervous because they are killing and they are doing this crime against humanity and now they're finding all of a sudden this, they, are, they, are, they may be answerable to somebody which they don't like.